Hi everybody, this is Alex at Belayed Sports. What we're gonna do, be doing is we're gonna be putting our new turbulator tape. It's a transparent aerodynamic tape that's gonna be post, posted up all over this car on specific spots to try to increase the airflow. So this car currently, this is a Toyota Sienna and it currently gets about, let's see. This currently gets 19 miles per gallon, 19.3. And we're going to be driving this around after we install our tape. What we're going to be doing is we're going to be putting it across the, the front of the hood here. Some underneath these windows or these mirrors, I'm sorry. Some underneath the mirrors. On the side of the car here. And then on our back roof spoiler here. Like, what is this tape? What is this tape? What does it do? It's a serrated tape that we saw done in Formula One for my Mercedes Patronus. Now, what this does is it keeps the air attached to the car, essentially. So when air is flowing, it wants to start to turbulate and it gets, it gets, creates more drag. So this, when this tape is on here, it helps keep the air flowing past the vehicle therefore reducing drag, increasing our mile per gallon on this vehicle. So right now I'm putting it on the side of this door here, just like this. And also because this tape is uh, like a one millimeter thick rubber ad adhesive essentially, if I open the door and hit somebody on the door, this is kind of like a little bit of a door guard. So it's kind of a little bit of dual purpose here. And we chose to be transparent so that way it doesn't really become like any sort of eyesore on the vehicle. And it just applies really simply, just like this. So right now we're installing right here on the top of the hood, right here. And a, a lot of people are gonna be asking, where do I put this? How do I know if, where I'm putting it is right? Well, the rule of thumb is you want to put this at the steepest part of any aerodynamic surface where the air is, where the air is going to start to turbulate. So right here, after it passes right here, it's going to want to turbulate over here. So right here, well, I'm putting it at the up here. So we want the air to move past this airfoil right here. So that way it goes up instead of... So right here, just trimming off my little edge here. No problem. And then the hood is pretty much done. You can't even really see it. And that's the best part. That's why we made it transparent. So this is the last spot that I'm gonna put the turbulator tape is on the roof because all the air is coming this way. We want it to try to stay attached as far as possible. And then before it starts to turbulate and, and detach and separate from the vehicle. All right. So we have our tape here. You can kind of see it right here, but it's really to the naked eye. We put some more right here on the mirror and under the mirror. So you can see right there, we have it here on our door. Again, also can be used as a door guard when you open up the door. And a little strip right back here, very clean. Now, when you look at the car, it just looks pretty much normal. No eyesores. So that's pretty much it. The car's uh, done with all the places that I wanted to put the turbulator tape. I started with about a 10 meter roll, and I'd say this is about halfway through. So I use about five meters. So we're gonna be recording the MPGs on this vehicle and see if we can get more. The odometer said about 19 miles per gallon and he just filled up. So usually he says he in city driving, he gets about like 21 on highway. He gets about like 24 miles per gallon. So even if we're get able to get a one mile per gallon increase on this turbulator tape, that's pretty much a win for us.